What up, what up, what up, what up, what up with it? Shamans in them. P.E. to the P.E. Positive energy. A.K.A. Bud Butts. A.K.A. H.I. A.K.A. Pep. A. Smith. Peace, man. Positive energy assures constant elevation. Because I'm constantly elevating over here. Y'all know what it is. One love. Uh, do a little bit of something a little, little slightly different. A little, little, little different. Just nothing major different. Just a little different. First, I'm going I'm to talk about uh, something that I was wrong about. A lot of people don't do that. A lot of people ain't going to do that. They, if they're wrong about it, they won't bring it up. They just hope you don't remember. But I'm going to bring it back up, let y'all know. And two, I'm going to talk a little bit about stand-up comedians. Okay, first and foremost, as it look right now, I was silly as fuck picking the Sixers to come out of the East and be in the final. Now, I, I know they didn't have Ben Simmons. They got swept in the first round. I, I, I couldn't have been more wrong. With or without Simmons, you ain't supposed to get swept in the first round. I can, I maybe even though y'all had to play the Celtics, which is a tough draw, swept completely wrong. I was enamored by the big name signing of of Horford. Thought him and Tobias Harris was gonna be enough to overcome Jimmy Butler leaving. I was wrong. I was wrong. No more than I can say. Then I was wrong, but. My Lakers are still alive, and that was my ultimate prediction anyway. So who would come out of the East and for them to play, to me, it's always been irrelevant. Because I always had the Lakers winning and against whoever, whether it was Giannis, whether it's the Raptors, can't be the Sixers, whether it's the Celtics, whichever one of them three want to come out. I still got the Lakers going, still got them winning. Still got AD as finals MVP. That ain't changed. That's that's what I'm still feeling and still alive and well to be happening. So, I just want to, you know, let that be known, acknowledge that, you know what I'm saying? And I was just listening to radio and my man, Max Kellerman, new show, appreciate it. It's all good. No, nothing but love for Max. You know what I'm saying? In my eyes, you know what I'm saying? That's a brother. If y'all know what I mean. I, that brother, I fucks with Max. Okay. But Max, you said something about Dave Chappelle not being qualified to be in your top three stand-up comedians. I mean, you said Chris Rock, Eddie Murphy, and you can argue Chappelle for the third shot. But first of all, first of all, Chappelle is hands down the goat of the stand-up comedian shit. No disrespect to Eddie, bro, because I fucks with Eddie heavy. And and I can even take Chris Rock as your third. You know what I'm saying? I can fuck with that. But Chris, I mean, Chappelle, man, come on, man. David? Chappelle? Somebody funnier than stand-up? No, we ain't talking about the movies. Okay, if you want to throw in the movies, Eddie got funnier movies, for sure. No doubt, I'm not arguing that. But he said stand-up comedian. He ain't say who's the funniest comedian all around. We're talking about getting the microphone, standing up in front of your audience, and rocking the motherfucking crowd. Number one, Dave Chappelle. Number two, Eddie Murphy. Number three, I'll give you Chris Rock. You know, I'll give you Chris Rock. Unless you want to go back and say Richard, the, the father and all that. Now, that, that Richard, just a little bit before my time, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, like on my sports, I don't really like, but you can go back and feel, but Richard was a little bit before my time, so I don't want to disrespect the GOAT, Richard, but I just ain't including him in mind because I didn't grow up listening to Richard. That's, that's that's the only thing I'm saying about that. So, Richard, you get a you get a you get a pass. Yeah, if y'all want to say he the goat, I'm not arguing with nobody. None of that about where his place is. I'm just simply not putting him on my list because he was before my time. Same thing with Red Fox. You know what I'm saying? I watched that for the Sun and all that. But come on, man. we talking about stand up when they was rocking the mic type thing. So, yeah. If anybody want to argue, I don't want to hear nothing about no day. Uh, what's that little uh, short little nigga Kevin Hart? I don't hear nothing about him. I don't want to hear nothing about no Mike Epps on the stand up. Funny ass smoke, even though I don't care nothing about you on the uh, stand up side. Um, 
that, I mean, like, who who you really gonna say other than Chappelle? I mean, Bernie Mac, rest in peace. Okay, I fuck with Bernie Mac. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Robert Harris, his, his shit was a little too short. He wasn't around, but he was a funny motherfucker. I'm not trying to leave him out, but, like, who you really gonna take out of? Like, Martin, come on, not on the run, run, tell that. No, no, I ain't, no, I ain't gonna run and tell none of that. So, yeah, it's your man's in the P to the P. Positive energy. We gonna have some peace. Half we can't mile. have peace. Turn left. Until we come together as one. One love.